Hi everybody and welcome back. Today I have more turnout exercises for you. So I think this is round three of turnout exercises and probably our last round in this challenge. Um, I just wanted to make sure you had lots of exercises for turnout because it was the number one most requested um, throughout this challenge. Turnout, posture, and straighter higher legs so hopefully I have given you the guys those things so today we have turnout I hope you enjoy it and let's get started just to get started everyone we're going to do one minute of just nice big hip circles okay so we're starting to heat up those hips get into all those muscles that help with our turnout so for one minute starting now good nice big circles okay good Go in one direction, then go in the other. So you can do like five, one direction, five the opposite and keep changing it up. Good, make them as big kind of as you can. Big, nice, loose circles. Heating up our hips, heating up all those rotatory muscles. Good, nearly halfway there. Good, keep going everyone. Good, keep changing direction, remember. You're also kind of heating up your hamstrings a little here as well, or will I confuse that and heating up? You might be funny, but this is a good exercise, especially as a warm up. Good, 10 more seconds. How is everybody feeling today? How are we all doing? I can't believe it's been almost 30 days of doing this together. Good. Okay, for the next exercise, we're going to be lying down. We're doing some circles. So we have done these a few times before. So we just open our legs up, or out and up, okay? So we're going to do 30 seconds one direction, 30 seconds the opposite. It is really just one of my favorite um, warm-ups for turnout, to work on your turnout. Because it warms up the muscles, but it also actually works them out for a stronger turnout. So try to keep, make sure you're trying to keep that turnout switched on the whole way throughout, okay? So one minute starting now. So the legs come up, we do a big circle and come back up. Good, big circle, come back up. Start to feel yourself working in to those hips. You can lift your head up if it's easier, but that will kind of switch on your abs. That's good if you want a little bit of an ab workout as well. Good. Good, take a little step. So the legs start, <laughs> so now we're gonna do 30 seconds. Legs start at the bottom, you circle up, then you push your legs down, okay? So you start at the bottom doing a circle up till they meet, and then you push your legs down. Okay, 30 seconds starting now. So circle up, push the legs down again. You can um, have your head up if you like. Remember, you're trying to keep that turnout switched on. Good. Nearly there, guys. If you're finding it tough, hang in there. Good. We're going to have lovely turnout. One more circle. Good. And relax. Okay. Next exercise I think we have done before as well, where we bring our heels together, we squeeze them together, and we push our knees in and out. Okay? Always believe that you have something really important between your heels as you push them out, okay? So starting now, knees come in, push out. So whenever they come in, you're starting to get a little bit of a stretch into the hip flexors to make them more flexible for better um, turnout. Then when you push them away, you're kind of activating the muscles, switch them on too. Good. Good, just a few more seconds, hang in there, you're doing really, really well. Last two, squeeze those heels together, get that turnout switched on, and relax. Really, really good, everyone. Okay, just a little bit of kind of a stretch. So if you bring the soles of your feet together, and feel like you're holding onto your feet and pushing them into your chest, okay? You can lift your head, I like to lift my head with this one. Good. So you're getting a stretch into kind of your inner thighs and to help 
um, get your flexibility into your turnout. With these videos, I always try to do like strengthening and stretching. So to get stronger, but also to get more flexible. So now if you want to keep your left foot in, push your right foot out to the side. Good. Notice if maybe you've gotten more flexible since the last time we've done this. Great. Putting the right foot in, send the left foot out to make sure I don't hit my flowers here behind me. Good, left foot in, right foot out. Good, and one more time, right foot in, left foot out. Good, both feet in. And I, I like to sometimes just kind of rock back and forth. Just enjoy that stretch, kind of like a butterfly stretch. Good, three, two, last one, come up. Good, all the way up into a nice butterfly. Good, okay. Next one we're going to do is called clams. So, you wanna lie down on one side. So I'm gonna take my right cheek towards the mat. I'm just gonna put my right hand underneath my face. Good, bend my knees in. Kind of feel like there's a little gap between my waist and the mat. And all we're going to be doing is just literally opening and closing the left leg, okay? So we're just trying to work on our outer muscles here now that help us be strong to have that turn out, okay? So we're gonna do one minute of this on both sides. You've got it. Ready? And go. So open and close. At the start of the minute, you will not feel like you're doing much at all. By the end of it, you might start to feel like you're doing a little bit more. That's what we're looking for, okay? Good, as always guys, if you're new to some of these exercises and you're finding them too tough, don't feel like you have to do the entire minute. That's just a goal. It also can be a goal for when you come back to this video someday and do it again, okay? So we're strengthening these outer muscles, these outer kind of rotatory muscles to get that turnout really strong. Good, you're more than halfway there. You've only 20 seconds left. Mine's is definitely starting to work now. Good. Really good guys, about five more seconds, hang in there. Good, and relax. Okay, before we turn around to the other side, we're going to do this. So we're gonna bring the, um, you can straighten both legs out, right? And you're gonna bring the left leg, you're gonna bring it in, up, and down, okay? In, up, and down. What we're doing is we're working those muscles we just worked on the outside, but we're also going to work the inside muscles as well to even get that rotation even more in our leg. So we're just gonna do 10 of those, ready? In, up, and down, good. Nine, good. Sometimes I like it to flex the foot on the way down. So I point, point, and flex. Point, point, and flex. Good, five more. You should be feeling this. Good, and relax, lovely. Okay, just before we turn around to the other side, we're just gonna kind of stretch out the glute because the glute would be working quite tough there. So cross the left foot over, or whatever leg you were working, cross it over, ankle over the knee, and then you pull the other knee into your chest. So I worked out my left side there, so I'm gonna stretch my left side. Good. So not too many exercises today, just more really quite focused exercises to get working on that turnout. Great, turn around now to the other side. Good, so you can take your left hand under your, your cheek or your face or whatever side you're doing. So the first thing we do is we do a minute of the open and close. We call them clams. Um, ready, one minute, starting now. Good, open and close. Good, two, really good guys, three, four, five, I'm counting them, which is silly because we got a full minute off them. 
Now you can also do these like this, it just makes it a little bit harder, so I wouldn't do for a full minute like that. But sometimes what I do is, you know the exercises we done kind of on our side in the first turnout video? Some days I'll just get down onto my side and do all of them. So I'll do this one, this one, I'll do legs up, I'll do legs kind of going everywhere and just really strengthen these muscles. It might not feel like you're doing much right now, but I promise you after I started this kind of stuff was when I really noticed an improvement in my dance and all these kind of Pilates moves, what we're doing right now. Good, Pilates is what I'm trained in as well, so it's usually what I like to do. A few more seconds, good, and relax. Really good, guys. So you know what comes next. We've got 10 of these, so we straighten the legs out. We bring it in, up, and down and I like to do the flex foot on the way down it kind of just stretches out my hamstring so 10 of those ready let's go in up and flex point point and flex good really feel those muscles working mine are working nice and hard now for some reason it's always the second side that I find more challenging I think it's because the first side is already tired good Give me three more, I forgot to count them. And two, good, last one, nice and slow. In, up and push down, really, really good. Okay, we're gonna do that stretch now. On the right side, get that right foot stretch. So ankle goes across the left knee and we pull the knee into our chest. Good, well done everyone. You're getting through these exercises quickly. It really is like all you need to do is like 10 minutes a day on something and um, I think is what I've learned from this challenge. If I take 10 minutes every day to do either turnout or toe height or flexibility or whatever it is, it makes a huge difference and sometimes what would happen is I would do a lot for a few days and then I'd go a four or five days and I ran out of time, I ran out of time whereas this challenge has proved to me that you can get 10 minutes every day to do something. I hope it's been the same for you guys. Okay, let's relax out of that and stand up. Okay, so for a minute now on each side. So for the next minute, we're gonna do 30 seconds on the right, 30 seconds on the left. We're just gonna bring the foot up and we go out and in, out and in. Good, we're really strengthening all these muscles now, okay? So one minute starts now. I'll tell you when to switch over and go out and in. I always lose my balance in these videos because I'm talking. Good. So the left leg is actually working hard here to your glute to keep you nice and balanced. Good. And your ankle. It's always good to work on our ankle stability. Good. Pushing that leg out as much as you can. Give me two more and then we'll swap over. One and swap. Good. Go straight into it. Go out, in and out, in. You're always trying to keep your hips forward, okay? Or the hip kind of bones, pelvic bones. Good. 15 more seconds, guys. Wonder can you hear my dog barking? <laughs> really try to push out you're nearly finished this video last one good and relax what we're going to do is you're going to be up on your toes and then all you're doing is you're bending and straightening and bending and straightening good as much as you can you're trying to keep the heels together but um, sometimes that doesn't always work sometimes your heels are together at the bottom and then when you're on your toes they're separated I totally, that's what happens with me as well, that's totally okay. But the idea is that you're trying to pull your heels together throughout. Okay, so 30 seconds, starting now. So you're on your toes for all of it, then you bend down and up. Good, down and up. Good, so you're not too high on your toes. We're trying to work, we're not really working on toe height here, we're working on our turnout, okay? Again, it might not feel like you're doing much, but I promise you, you will see benefits if you keep doing these exercises good. 
Give me five more. Five, four, three, two. Good. Last one. And relax. Well done, everyone. Okay. Let's just kind of um, stretch out those muscles that we're working hard. First thing I want you to do is get down into a nice pigeon stretch. So it's where you bring the ankle in and then you push the other leg back. Good. Yesterday's video we had a nice kind of leg stretch. It was really nice. Good, see if you can lift the back foot up and then you're getting a nice stretch into kind of the um, left quad as well. Good, and relax that foot down and switch over. So left ankle and knee comes forward, and then you push the right foot back. Good. Really good guys, see now if we can lift up the right foot, reaching with the left hand. Good, and relax down. Now I want us to get on to, we're going to be like left foot out, right foot is kind of, you're on your toe. Good, I just want you to do a few pass back and forward, so you go from like left to right. Good, so you're stretching all those kind of inner muscles there that have worked quite hard. Good, now keep both knees bent and just kind of enjoy that deep squat. Good, you can rise up onto your toes and down and up onto your toes and down. Two more like that, two and one. Good. Bring the knees in a little bit closer. See if you can bring your hands to your knees. Just kind of sit down nice and low into that stretch. Good. You can kind of pass back and forth. I always like to kind of just dance in whatever stretch I'm doing. Good. And all the way up. And I'm going to come down to just the top two so you can see me. Well done, everybody, on another turnout and workout. Really, really simple, nice and quick and easy, but effective if you do it a few times a week. As always, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so, so much for joining me. And um, be sure to hit the like button, hit subscribe, and hit the bell to be notified of all my future videos. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, everyone.